What is up everybody? Jayco here today in the middle of uh, doing my workout. So I like, when I'm doing my workout, I like to talk about workout things. So today I want to talk about, um, you know, how my life changed. I know I made a video about this before. Sorry, my camera's a little cockeyed. It's sitting on something that's like this right now. So hopefully you guys can bear with me. So, and I'm sorry for the echo as well. So when I used to work out right before I noticed I had a hernia. I used to work out so, so hard. And then once I figured out I had a hernia, I slowed down a little. And then once I knew the hernia was causing pain and other problems, I cut down a lot more. Then I had my surgery. And then I was supposed to take off for a month. I took off for about two weeks. And I started working out in my house. And then once my month was cleared, I was back in the gym. Now, what's crazy is now what I'm saying could be mostly a mindset thing, but it's something that I view because I have a personal Instagram for my training business and I realized looking at those pictures and photos and videos that things have changed a lot for me. Like my results have changed a lot for me. So I'm actually gonna put the camera down here because I'm about to do an ad workout. Now you might, in your opinion, you guys are like, Jake, you, you know, you look amazing, you look good. Thanks, I understand that, and I probably do look good most of it to the average person, but at the end of the day, I don't feel anywhere near as what I used to be. And it sucks, and no matter how hard I train, you know, I suffer, like, recently I've had lower back problems for the last three weeks, I have um, left and right elbow problems, and I have left wrist pain. So a lot of things, like I've barely ever had pain when I lift a lot more and more often before my hernia surgery. So it's like when you, when you get back to it, and not that I came back in rushing, like lifting the same weight as before, I came back in lifting low weight, and I still had you know, severe pain. So not only that, the, if you are somebody who's natural like myself, who doesn't take any supplements besides a pre-workout, and you stop working out, you're gonna lose your results really, really fast. And there's so many times where I slowed down, they came back, and the muscle came back right away. But as you get into your mid-20s, and obviously older, it's a lot harder and harder and harder to get your muscle back. So my advice is if you're working out, you don't have to lift heavy, you don't have to do a lot, just continue to do it and pace yourself or you're gonna feel like me where my results just like flew out the window, in my personal opinion. Now, like I said, I'm a, I'm a trainer so I can't feel not confident in any single way and that's how I feel right now. I don't feel like the Superman that I used to be. I feel like uh, Robin Boy right now. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Put your back over here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna continue my workout. I'm out of breath because I'm talking the same time I'm lifting. So that's not obviously not the best idea. So like I said, back to my workout. Hope you all have a great day. And hopefully you guys take this advice and, and learn from it. Don't stop training. Keep going, but you don't have to go hard and try not to get hurt. Avoid injuries. Take care, guys.